Big tech companies love asking this dynamic programming question. So let's get it right. We're given an array of numbers where each number is the amount of money that is stored in a particular house. And we want to rob the maximum amount of money. We can rob however many houses we want, with the exception that we cannot rob two adjacent houses because that would trigger the police. And in this example, the answer is 10 and 4, which makes 14. So we'll build up a dynamic programming array that always has the max amount of money we could have at each step. We have two options. Do we want to rob this house or do we not? Well, if we do rob that house, we can't get the value from this because that would trigger the alarms. But we could get the value from here. So we could get 5 plus 3 equals 8, or we could just keep what we had and not rob it, which is 10. And that's what we'd prefer. Do we want to rob this house? Well, we can and get 4 plus this 10, which is 14, and we're going to be left with 14. Here's my Python code if you'd like to check it out. Want to learn this stuff directly from me in a live class? Book a call at algomap.io slash bootcamp.